What's going on, people? I'm that driving guy, and my office gets me where I'm going. So in this video, we're going to talk about dashing on Thanksgiving. A lot of people may be wondering if it's worth worth it to go out and dash. And some of you may have decided that you want to dash for your first time on Thanksgiving, and you want to uh, get a little heads up on what to expect. So I wanna provide you guys with all of that information so that you can either create a good strategy and go out there and get that money or just you know, help make up your mind on whether or not you wanna go out at all. So if this is your first time watching, go ahead and subscribe, hit the bell and hit all so you get the notifications every time I drop a video. All right, so let's get to it. So working on Thanksgiving, I've worked a couple of Thanksgivings. And, um, you know, f from what I can remember, a lot of restaurants usually closed earlier. So um, I don't remember the last Thanksgiving, it wasn't as busy, but the two days before Thanksgiving, the Tuesday and the Wednesday, those are going to be your money makers. Those are going to be the days that you're going to want to be out there to get the money. You may receive a lot more bigger orders. Keep that in mind. You may receive a lot more bigger orders. Every market is different, but I've dashed in three different states. And out of the two, um, I've dashed uh, on Thanksgiving in Texas and in California. This will be my if I decide to go out this Thanksgiving. So the two days beforehand are usually busy. You get a lot of bigger orders. You may have a little bit more longer of a wait time, but fortunately a lot of restaurants have an area for dashers to pick up. So you can usually skip the line, get your order and be out. You usually don't have to wait in the line. So that's a good thing right there. That's a plus. So a lot of businesses, people that are still working, they may have meetings, they're going to be making orders. So pay attention to the number of items and everything else that you will need to pick a, the best order for you. And you can go out there and get that money. Now, on Thanksgiving, as I said, a lot of restaurants may possibly be closed. So it would be good if you did decide to go out to do your research and find out what restaurants are going to be open and or if they're going to close early. A lot of good places to be are restaurants that provide people with meals. Uh, places like a Boston Market or restaurants like that um, that allow people to get uh, a lot of food at one time large orders those are going to be big orders for you as well if you do receive any orders what I like to do is if I did choose to go out for Thanksgiving I usually my thing is I'm an early riser I'm up at 4 o'clock in the morning every morning 4 a.m. so my thing is if I'm going to go out I'm going to go out and be back before the football game start so that can be a strategy that you use right there. Go somewhere where you know that meals are served, that deals with DoorDash, and that's usually going to be a hot spot. And set your time, set your, your, a limit for yourself. Because at a certain time, usually between four and six, restaurants start closing early. So there's not going to be anything for you to get out there anyway, unless it's at a McDonald's or a Subway there are restaurants that are going to be open, but it's going to be places like that. So you you may not be receiving a lot of big orders. It could possibly be busy, but with a lot of smaller, smaller orders from there. Because those are going to be the only restaurants that are still going to be open. So again, to recap, like I said, a heads up. Pay attention to the Tuesday and the Wednesday. Th these are going to be the, the two days that you're going to really get your money. Those are going to be where you get your larger orders. On Thursday, if you decide to go out, go out early and get your money and be in areas that are known to provide meals for customers. And what I would say is 
take a break. If you, you know, it's a holiday, take a break, be with the family, chill out, relax. A lot of people are traveling, so there may even be busier roads and you know you want to stay safe. That's the main thing. You want to be safe. So kick back, relax, watch the games, eat some food, and then get ready to, you know, get it popping the next day. All right. So hopefully that information was was good for you guys to, you know, help you decide what you're going to do and give you a heads up if you decide to go out. If it was good information to you, you know what I mean? If you like it, then like it. You feel me? If not, drop me a comment and let me know, uh, you know, your thoughts about it. And if you have any information and tips, drop that in the comments as well, because we're here to help everybody and provide this information and, and help everybody get money as best it, as they can. So, you know, help out with that as well. I appreciate you all. Until next time, I'm a holler.